The Better Business Bureau has issued a warning about what it calls ghost tax preparers. Around this time of year, some tax preparers set up shop, usually in a rental or a short-term location, that may often promise fast or large refunds to taxpayers. But the big refunds they promise may not be calculated in legal ways. To protect themselves, the BBB says these ghost tax preparers will actually prepare the tax return, but when it's submitted to the IRS, they asked the taxpayer to sign their own return, making it look like it was self-filed by the taxpayer. And since this return is self-filed, that taxpayer is then liable for any errors that the ghost preparer made. That includes all the penalties because the large refund promised was not accurate in the first place. So here's what you need to know. Back in 2006, the IRS began to require all tax preparers to have what's called a preparer tax identification number, a PTIN. And if you run into a preparer that does not want to include their PTIN and sign the return, take your tax documents and take your business somewhere else. I've got more tips about ghost tax preparers right now on my Facebook page. I'm Brian Roach on your side, WGAL News 8.